Number four, be honest about what you want. Um, and this goes back to like settling. If you're not being completely honest about what you want, you're only gonna attract, you're not gonna attract what you want. So for me, and part of my defense mechanisms were me trying to tell myself that I just I just want something casual. I don't want a relationship. I don't want blah blah blah. I wasn't being honest with myself. I didn't really believe maybe no not maybe. I didn't believe that I could get what I truly wanted. I had to be honest about the fact that I do want to fall deeply in love with someone. I want that. And I couldn't be honest with myself about it before. And I don't mean like TV fairy tale love, I mean like true, true love because it's not that stuff you see on the TV. There's great, there, there are those aspects to true love, but also like the raw, ugly, not so glamorous part of love. I want those things too. I had to be honest about the fact that I do want to meet someone who treats me like I'm special. I didn't, I lied to myself and thought like it was okay to accept whatever and I was accepting whatever. I made it sound like, oh, it's, it is what it is. It is what it is. <laughs> like, no, no. I want someone who cares about me. I want someone who considers how I feel. I want someone who calls me, just check on me just to see how my day's going. I want someone who will send me flowers, even though I don't really like flowers. I don't really like flowers, but it's the thought that counts, right? Like little things like that. I want the corny aspects of relationships too. Yeah, I want that. Romance. Romance. I want romance too. Yeah. So be honest about what you want. Uh, that was very superficial, but I mean like on a deeper level, what values are you looking for? Um, that serious stuff like be honest about that stuff too and number five you have to try and it's terrifying <laughs> the other stuff is work too but this one is like actually applying all that other stuff the truth is every day like every day you get up you're one day closer to dying you're one day closer to not being able to try so it's worth it the worst that could happen is, yes, you get your heart broken again, but what if you don't? What if you don't get your heart broken? And I've learned that despite everything that I've been through, um, every situation, connection, everything has taught me something about life, but more importantly, about myself. And that is Those are my tips and you have to really really apply them guys like you have to apply them and some days you'll do great some days you won't some days you'll relapse to your old habits and situations and other days you'll be able to say nope I deserve better I know what I want I know what I'm worth and that's a great feeling when you can get to that point it's beautiful I made a promise to myself that I wasn't going to get in any more mediocre situations. Like the next, dare I say, relationship that I get into, I will actually show up. Am I getting teary and emotional? Um, I will actually show up.